Oh, well. I almost made it. It was one more battle. You know what? Dude, keep it in your pants. My priest is terrible. Oh, well. Okay, so that didn't quite work out. Which is a shame. Uh... A duke for ransom. Oh, Prince Saxa. Apparently you were kidnapped at some point. Um, yeah, I'll ransom you for 50 bucks. So welcome home. <laughs> um, I'm sure it's fine. Uh, you, stop running away so I can disband you. There we go. And how's my council looking? People are happy. People are content. Things are happening. Uh... Did integrate happen? Apparently. Interesting. Um, so what does integration do? Slow process, the titles de jour liege can change. It occurs naturally when a duchy or kingdom is completely controlled by a ruler. Oh, okay. So I've... I've pretty much made Greasons to be a natural part of my territory, is what I'm understanding. But I can do Lombardia or Linguac. Interesting. Okay, fair enough. Uh, stop doing that. Focus on domestic affairs. That's fine. Everybody's happy. Excellent. Kidnapped you for extra beer money. That's exactly it, man. <laughs> um, okay, so we lost apparently some territory to Pomerania. I can declare war, but I can't declare war for any particular reason, so that's interesting. Uh, Bavaria, I can still declare war on you. Uh, Italy was apparently swallowed, um, which is fascinating. Venice, can I declare war on you? No. Okay. So Italy is falling apart. Um, how are we looking otherwise? There's a lot of really tiny territories in Central Europe, and I would love to just come up and swallow them. Um... And it says I can declare war on this duke, but I don't think I can. So... You're still changing a religion. How about Lothringia? Do I have a reason to attack you? No. East Franconia? No. Uh, West Fran Franconia? No. Apparently Mercia is in the middle of Europe now can declare war on them, but don't have a reason to, I think this game might be glitching out slightly. Because it's telling me I can declare wars, but it's not letting me declare wars, if that makes sense. Um, new Marshall perk, that's nice. Um, let's do organized march, because movement speed is very handy. Okay, the challenge. I'm sparring with one of my soldiers, sweat beating on my forehead, when I experience the uncanny sensation of being watched. Looking over my shoulder, I spot my vassal, Mayor Raymond, who waves at me. I walk over to greet him. We talk about our weapon practice for a while, trading tricks and advice. Just as I'm about to leave for another round, Mayor Raymond's face lights up and he suggests we practice together. Uh... Yeah, okay, challenge accepted. A mace at my throat. The sounds of swords clashing against mace echoes between the courtyard walls. All eyes are on us. Everyone wants to see the king fighting his vassal. I must be tired from my previous practice because I move sluggishly, unable to keep up with my opponent. When I lunge, he's already gone, and my parries come at the very last moment. It is not long before I find myself on the ground before him. I can say I yield and gain 50, 
or I can risk getting wounded. No, I yield. That's fine. Um, so I can apparently king declare war on King Grim if I have 300... Huh. If I have 300 per, uh, piety, I could declare war for that kingdom. That's interesting. Um, Boreas, sunny day. As I make my way to the stable, I'm greeted by the happy neighs of Boreas. She seems eager to stretch her legs in the beautiful weather, and I can do nothing but agree. Um, get diligent training and prowess plus one, but no, let's lose 30 stress. That's fine. So, let's see. What can I do? I'm 72. I'm, I'm in poor health. I'm not in great health anymore. Um, I've still got a pile of troops. Up to 10,000 now that I'm actually increasing my marshal. Um, Flanders, I can't declare war on you. Yeah, I still have... I still have red lines around these kingdoms for no particular reason. It has to be a visual glitch. Like, there's there's no point in having that there otherwise. Get Aquitaine off these guys. Or Navarra. Or this Sultanate. Which I don't actually need. Um, get the Duchy of Aragon off these guys. Which is interesting. It's a big pile of, of uh, location, but it's not something I actually need right now. Um, Bavaria. There's some clams I can actually use. Um, neither of those are ones that I want. Can't declare war on you. Can't declare war on you. Luxembourg, no. France, I can declare war on you. Both for the Duchy of Toulouse probably not going to bother with that, to be honest. Uh, East Franconia, no. Bohemia, no. Salzburg. Probably yes, but no. Hungary, what do you have? Okay. So who can I actually declare war on? You. And declare war for this county. You know what? Screw it. It's an easy one. Probably more than we actually need. There we go. Single county, real quick war. That's fine. Oh no, my sister died. Oh no! And I've got a mental break off of it. Um. <sighs> well, I can get reclusive. What does that do for me? Diplomacy and stewardship minus one. You know what? I'm paranoid. I might as well be reclusive too. There we go. But yeah, my sister died. That sucks. She was a genius. She never had any children, which is a shame. I was really hoping she would. What can I imprison this guy for? Because he tortured one of my family members. Good God. Uh, somebody is plotting to kill my courtier. That's interesting. Um, yeah, it's all fine. I've still got low county control. So I'm hoping that I'm able to actually get the the uh, marshal to move around a bit.
Okay, there's the siege. Uh, I can ransom some folks. And just execute you. Okay, execute her. That's probably fine. Execute you. Yep, execute you too. There we go. Everybody will be scared of me. And you, enforce demands. I will be taking this territory. Thank you very much. Uh, I will also grant this territory to... My grandson? He's not doing anything, and he's not bad. Yes, I will give it to my grandson. There we go. This is fine. Okay, a little bit more of a territory. That works. Uh, Bourbon, can I do anything with you? I cannot. Uh, Duchy of Frisia, really? So I can seize that. I can seize that. I can get a single kingdom, or the kingdom of England. I can get a single duchy, a single county... Either one of those, or I can enforce their claims. What are your claims? Kingdom of East Francia. I mean, yeah, let's uh, enforce her claims. Although, it won't be part of my territory, I don't think, because she'll become a queen. I believe. And that's not exactly what I need. Um, I mean, we could try it anyway. Yeah, let's uh, let's try it. I don't think it'll work, but let's try it. And go ahead and raise a bit of the troops. That's plenty. You can probably carpet siege a little bit, so let's raise a few more. That's fine. Split you in half. Excellent. One of you will go here. And the other one will go here. Okay, that's that siege. Uh, let's go and take out that barony as well. Leather-bound secrets. That sounds dirty. Uh, my contacts have sent me a tome written in some strange code. It's leather covers decorated with uh, my master's symbols. Uh, I've only been able to decipher the first few pages so far, but they're deeply fascinating. Um, I can gain one martial lifestyle Kirk, but gain critical stress levels again. Um, I can sell it for 115 bucks. Uh, I can make, I can make John Rambo a witch, <laughs> um, which is interesting. Yeah, screw it, let's make him a witch. I have an unobstructed view of the tome which I left on Count John Rambo's desk from the secret passage behind his chambers. I'm an evil man. His eyes are drawn to it as soon as he steps over the threshold, almost as if the book possesses its own strange magic. When John Rambo has finished reading the translated pages, he begins to pace back and forth. In the end, the tome's draw seems impossible to resist. He rushes back to the desk and grabs a quill. And now I know he's a witch. <laughs> I've created a witch out of my grandson. <laughs> I am not a nice person. My god. I'm 73 years old. I'm still... I have 38 intelligence. Hold on. 
Uh, what is it? Find? Yes. I am literally the most intelligent person in the planet by 10. Yeah. That's insane. I have a learning of 38. So I am the most intelligent person by far. Good God. Good God. And I'm 73. And I'm still just kind of feeling poor. <sighs> well, Denzian's in Bourbon. Wait, does that mean I can declare war on you? No, because you're not Waldensian yet. Wait, yes, you are. Why can't I holy war you? Ah, because my armies are raised. Right, so after this war, I'll take over him, too. Well, you don't have enough troops. Interesting. In which case, you can join him. Um, a liberty war against who? The Duke of Frisia? Sure. I don't really care, but I'll join in. Ah! New dynasty perk. That's nice. I can get two at 1,000. Or I can get one of the level twos. Um, convergent blood. Trance of reinforcing congenital traits. 30%. That's nice. Uh, Cassus belli cost minus 20%. That's interesting. Uh, prestige plus 10%. Just flat. That's interesting, too. Uh, I can also get 20% Dread Gain, Popular Opinion plus 5, uh, Courtier and Guest Opinion plus 10, and Fertility 10%. I'm actually going to get Popular Opinion plus 5, which is very, very handy. Um, and then I'm also going to get Ominous Reputation. Because why not? Okay, there we go. We're down to five renown, but we are getting almost six a month. Well, five, five and a quarter. 108 living members, capped at 100. Two kings, one count, one king by marriage, and one count by marriage. Nice. All right. Still busy taking over a kingdom. And, oh, they moved the capital up there. Okay, fair enough. What task was finished? Increase county control. Nice. Um, is the county control in Greece in 100? Go ahead and go to Como. Oh. Apparently, you are in police and crane control somewhere else. Never mind, that's fine. Can ransom this kid for 50. Go for that. And you can marry. Who are you? My grandson. Um. Yeah, I don't need inbred children. Um. Clear that. Because that's my granddaughter. Uh, you're my courtier. You're intelligent. Good odds it'll actually mix intelligent together. Yeah, let's do that. Alright. Not bad. A secret exposed. My vassal, Duke Simon, has had an extramarital affair with his lover, Elf Eventhia. I mean, that makes sense. Apparently, how dare they, but, you know, no, that makes sense. Uh, another call to war. Holy war for the sheikdom of Ibizia. Sure. Now we're going to war down here. Okay. First things first, I'm a little busy. Although I probably should move this all the way down here and actually raise the rest of my horses.
Not that I have many left, mind. I have some. Got wars all over the map going on. Alright. This is fine. Excellent. And you. Everything's good up here. Okay. So far, so good. Took that just fine. Um, I wonder if I can take this, because I think they're in a war with the same people I am. Okay, they converted the true faith. That's nice. Uh, court, you, okay, more faith. Wow, when did that happen? My people are converting left and right to places I did not want to do. Um, what are you, Iconoclast? You're Waldensian? Yeah, get Waldensian out of here, and then we'll get the Iconoclast. Wait, when, what, what happened? You got defeated? Apparently, yes. Yes, you did. Interesting. New Marshall perk. Um, let's do hit and run. That's what happens when you fight wars in two different areas. Um, so you're fine. Just move you up there. And you can actually siege that. Nice. My spymaster is coming to me with great news. Somebody is trying to kill my grandson, Lucino. Well, what bastards? Uh, don't need an alliance with you. I'm pretty sure you're fairly weak. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna call you into this war. No. No. Or that one. Go to that war. Oh well, whatever. Right. Right. Should have paid attention to that. Uh, whoa, who are you? Venice is declaring war on me for a single county. He's got 10,000 troops. Um, well, that's interesting. And I just lost a handful of mine due to not paying attention to where the hell I was walking. Um, okay. Interesting. Well, I'm going to be calling in my allies left and right. Um, do you actually have any troops? You do. Get out of here. That one. And that one. You will also come to this war. You will also come to this war. Uh, might as well get you allied and then we'll call you in as well. What else we got? I think that's it. I can create a duchy. Somewhere. Over here. Um, we might as well. Just for funsies. Close this. We've got a 
few people that actually have territory here. Uh, how are you? You're... Nah, you're okay. You're intelligent. You... Also intelligent. You... You're my... Grandson? Yes. So you honestly get the title. Oh, right. So, okay. You... There we go. So I've got an alliance with you. Grant you the title of that duchy. Excellent. Now then, strategical, strategical impasse. I'm sitting around a map table with Duke Anso and Duke Anfos, discussing our strategy for the ongoing war. Anso eagerly points out all the prime targets we should immediately send raiding parties to village, while Anfos nervously mutters about how we should avoid unnecessary engagements and fight a war of attrition. It is my right to decide our ultimate course of action. Uh... I can improve avoidance or improve pillaging. Siege time reduction. Um... I'm going to do that one. That's fine. Uh, so much going on. Okay. I want to siege up here. That That's handy. Um, you guys can merge. And... Just go over here for now. I'm hoping that my allies tune, turn up and actually fight this war for me until I can show up. Because right now, I don't know what I'm going to do about it. Hey. Aw. Countess Deke, uh, the spouse in, of my son and heir, has passed away. All those carefully crafted plans have been crushed by death's fickle impulse. Though such complaints might seem petty and unsubstantiated compared to her family's pain. My son that I wanted to inherit the throne at the beginning of this night uh, is now 52. Um, so that's interesting. Let's get him a new wife. Um... His claims on a bunch of duchies. You can marry her. Rest in peace. And I'm now allied with somebody of Limburg. Um, how many troops do you have? 200. You're not worth it. Uh, you have only 42. Okay. So that works. Ha. <sighs> I'm just having people die left and right. I'm 75. Good God. How am I still alive? I have a prowess of zero because I'm so old. Boreas, my trusty mare. A renowned trainer has approached me after hearing rumors of my mighty mare and offers his services. All I ask in return is small compensation. She needs to be stronger. She needs to be more swift. Work on her endurance. Fierceness. Um... Let's make her more swift. Oh, nice. So I gain martial plus one, learning plus one. No, wait. No? What did I, what did I get? Prowess plus one. Also, my culture discovered horseshoes. Go culture. Okay. Okay, that siege is done with... Is there anywhere else I need to siege? I'm at war with you. I might as well take you over, I guess. That siege should be... Yep, finished. And that's 100%. Let's just enforce those demands. Okay. So what did I get? I got 300 prestige... I've got a favor hook on you. 
who is the despot of East Francia. So yeah, it didn't go to my kingdom like I thought it would. So that makes sense. Um, I'm still at war with you because of the alliance and you as well. That's fine. I do have enemy troops here. No, move you to there. There we go. Raise the rest of my uh, armies there. How many wars do you guys want me to be in? The answer is all of them. He's got 76 pikemen and you don't. I don't think that's going to work out. Plus, I'm the king and I'm bad at this, so disband you. Uh, apparently I don't need to siege that. Go siege that? Yes. <sighs> Who are you? What war are you in? Not that war. Probably. Uh, how about this war? No. What's this one? No. Are you sure it's not this war? I have no idea who you are and why you're attacking me. Vassal of East Francia. Okay, whatever. I'm hoping that they enforce those demands real quick, because I don't want to be in these wars anymore. They're at 100%. Come on now. There you go. Uh, I have also discovered uh, manorialism. So now I get the economic buildings. That's nice. Communal government will get me... Counties now reach a maximum existing de development penalty at twenty at thirty five. Okay, so development increase or naval speed increase. Let's get the development increase. That's fine. Is there anywhere else I should be sieging? Okay, that's all done. Uh, you. Apparently you can go to war with this. I don't know why I'm at war with you, but we are. I'm still at war with Venice, who has a pile of troops. Seriously, why am I at war with you? County of Frisia. Okay. Your liege is the Duke of Frisia. Your liege is East Francia. Um, that's uh, just another visual glitch, isn't it? Okay. Down you go. Oh no, my horse is sick. Um... No, save the horse. I like the horse. Let's get all of my remaining troops together. Is that everybody? That's everybody. Merge! Um, and we'll go and fight Venice. Yeah. 
Excellent. I get more increased attacks. That's handy. Uh, you also go down here. Ah, so many wars. So many wars. Hey, my my prince bishop converted a culture. That's nice. Don't know what the hell else is going on in the kingdom. Stretches too damn far. What do you want? East Francia. Sure. The Waldensians are uprising. Lady, you're not going to live through it, but that's fine. Oh, not another fucking war. Fine. Yes, a point of beneficiary. Um, my grandson. He can be the beneficiary. That's fine. Okay, I'm raiding Venice. I'm also apparently attacking these guys and losing. Which is fair. Um, I have no idea what my ally for that is. You have 83 troops. Good job, buddy. New martial perks available. Uh... Let's get Parthian taxic Tactics. New Cadet Branch. That works. What prisoners do we have? Uh, right. Ransom you. We have a pile of more prisoners. Nice. Um, through downcast lashes, as my eyes meet Duchess Stephanie's for what feels like the 20th time tonight, I know I am not imagining things. Even from the other end of the table, her gaze feels as intense as the midday sun. She wants me, and I cannot lie, I want her too. Or is punishing her husband what I truly desire? Does it even matter? Who are you? You're the wife of one of my dukes. Uh, no. I must remain pure. I don't, I don't care about her anyway. So, you... No... What religion are you? Just let you go then. Uh, you... Ransom you? No. You're kind of useless. You can just go. You... Nobody will pay for you. Get out. You... 100 bucks for you. Why is that? No important people. So, okay. We'll, uh, we'll ransom you. Hundred bucks. Nice. A uh, stranger has bought before me. She's been waiting outside the gates for a week. Um, how is she? She's possessed. Uh, no, no thank you. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, you need to come over here. What kind of commander traits do you have? Uh, Holy Warrior and Forder. That'll have to work. We are now in the High Medieval Era. I was hoping they would actually take the bait. Um, got 8,500. 
in mountains. This is plains. Hopefully catch somebody. No. There we go. Caught somebody. Caught literally one person. But, you know, somebody. Uh, that was bad. That was bad. They lured me onto hills. Crap. Uh, and I lost my marshal. Well, you get to be marshal now. Keep gaining county control. Ugh, I might be getting too tired to be playing this. Um... down to essentially that many men. Yeah, I lost a lot of troops there. That sucks. Um, what can I do? I can call in more allies. Do you have any troops? You do. Right, come on in. Uh, you. Do you have any troops? You do. And you. Do you have any troops? You won't come. Okay. Uh, I can ask my head of faith for gold. I may as well. Um, I can ransom you for 50 bucks, so sure. Um... Right. Otherwise, not much going on. Also, there's a Waldensian uprising I'm fighting, but I haven't been involved in. Got 1,400 gold for use. Um, can't upgrade my castle yet. Can I upgrade you? No. You I can upgrade. Yeah, okay. Upgrade that. I've got 6,000 troops, but they're all spread out. So if I just counter siege... I wonder if that'll work. Some family members can get married. Uh, you. You're 16? 18. What happened to your husband? I thought you had a husband. Okay, never mind. Um, not marrying my grandson. He's 57 and useless. He's also my grandson and has lover pox. Uh, he's 34 and robust. What about matrilineal? He's a carling. That'll be interesting. Yeah, mix the carlings in mine. Uh, and you. Also matrilineal. Uh, 16, kinda useless. What about you? Less useless. You're, you're less useless, we'll take you. Uh, what titles can be created? The Kingdom of Navarra and the Duchy of Sis uh, Vis Viscaya. Where's that at? Yes, thank you. Somewhere? Oh, over here. Okay. Uh, I still don't have that many men. Yes, we will also take the stress away with the horse. Good. got a thousand men coming to me from allies we got a, a crusade going on assault the fort get it over with there we go 
Uh, I'm hoping that some of these guys will actually get involved and help me fight. Apparently we're taking over all of this. That's interesting. Um... Not enough supply there. Let's retake Parma. Ah, I'll be dead within a year. So I'll, I won't hit 80. That's a shame. I think after this guy dies, we're probably going to call it a night. I am exhausted. Um, got 8,000 people coming. Ugh. Every county in the faction increased autonomy. Jesus. No, fight the peasants. Okay, we lost the Holy War, that's fine. Ugh. Yeah, they're gonna. Yeah, they're gonna get right on top of me. <sighs> and my heir has been taken hostage. Marshall's dead. Awesome. Um, you can take it because you expect it, but otherwise you're kind of shitty. Um, are none of my allies actually helping? None of them. Excellent. All of my good commanders are now dead. So that's nice. Um, got a Reaver and a Forder, which isn't terrible. It's not good, but it's not terrible. Um, my Liege is about to die anyway. We might lose Parma, which I'm not stoked about. But we could always get it back when we actually have better troop supplies and I wasn't fighting six wars at once. Um, Army of Amsterdam? Really? Okay. Uh, somebody's trying to kill my granddaughter. People are always trying to kill my family, man. It's just what they do. I've got, I've got a lot of them. I've got I've got 120 family members. Like good odds that somebody's trying to kill somebody at some time. Uh don't have enough supply where I'm standing. Go stand here. My spy master is coming with grave news. She is certain that Lo Lovica is my own granddaughter is scheming against my knight Harold. Who are you? And why would you scheme against my knight? You? Why? What's Harold got to do with it? I'm not gonna accuse her. She's my family member. She's doing things against other families. It's probably fine. In a terrible sort of way. Um I think we're going to lose Parma. Oh, and I've died. Ah, he played for 58 years. Good God. Uh, let's see here. Yep, age of 79. Uh, living legend and paragon of virtue. 
he finished on the lifestyle of Marshall and took place in 37 wars, 19 offensive, 14 defensive, and 4 offensive Great Holy Wars. Wow. King John Rambo of Burgundy has found peace in Christ's embrace at 79 years of age. He died of unknown causes. I died of old age. Let's face it. A keen and dedicated hunter, he loved to spend entire weeks in the wilderness looking for the most elusive game. King John Rambo Part 2, who's 56 and dying already, um, ascends to the throne. Beautiful beyond words, his appearance will have foreign dignitaries groveling at his feet. Ah. Uh, Sid Swizzle's inherited a duchy, but he's in prison, so that's not handy. But yeah, that's where we're at. Um, apparently, I'm on a hunt. Apparently, I'm on a hunt. All right, then. Um, and with that, I'm probably going to call it a night. Um, what has he been working on? This is fine. Um, I need a beneficiary. So, yes, still you... Uh, I have an available perk, so absolute control is nice. Let's do that. Um, yes, all of this. And I have empty council positions. Wow, do I ever. Um, you can take that. I've got nothing for stewards, so you can take that. I've got nothing for marshals, uh, you. And I've got some decent intrigue. Uh, you. There we go. This is fine. Uh, my army size has dropped by about 4,000 men. Because this guy's just not as good. So that'll be interesting. Um, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, I have been Leftosian, and... Let's see if we can't raid somebody real quick, because we happen to be going. Uh, we'll read Trash Story. That's fine. Ah, <sighs> Fun times. Fun times had by all. Everybody have an excellent night, and I will see you uh, tomorrow, actually.